In modern war, you will die like a dog for no good reason. Yep. This war of mine is an older game by now. It came out in 2014, developed and published by 11-Bit Studios. And it's, it's a great game, I've heard. Also a very sad game and devastating. So be warned, uh, it's about war. It's about the tragedies of war for like the individual person who's just trying to survive. It is very topical. I understand if that's something you don't want to see right now, but it is topical. So, so why not play it, right? Kind of sad, but let's check it out. I've never played it. I've never watched anybody play it before. Somebody gifted me the game and why not? Why not try this? You haven't played it in so long. Please, please consider everybody now that this is my first playthrough. Do not spoiler stuff. If I forget something, feel free to tell me. If I miss something super obvious, of course, tell me. But, but let, let me experience that, all right? You can guess stuff with me, as always. But let's, let's just share this, all right? Have, have fun with this together. As much fun as we can with a game like this, but... Thank you, Energy Max. Ho hopefully, we'll see. 11-bit studios do like to hurt our feelings, yes. Just look at Frostpunk. Yeah. Hmm. I'm not sure as Larum. I've never played Death Stranding, I can't say. I know FG has played Death Stranding. I'm not sure about the d director's cut, though. Okay, yeah, so... Survive. Try to survive in a besieged city. There's a workshop center. Oh, for mods and stuff. And then a stories mode, but that's that's a different thing. So we're going to do the survive stuff, I suppose. Um, okay. Those might be the credits. Survive. Let's go. I'm very, very expectant right now. Day one. Welcome to hell. Look at the art style though. I mean, you've probably seen it, but the art style. We're ready, we are not ready. Oh no. Looks amazing. You know one thing about the game? You won't spoil it, thank you. Thank you. Oh, I see. I thought I thought maybe there was a cutscene or something. How long has the siege lasted? It's hard to say when every day is a struggle for survival. The city is crawling with snipers. Shelling is ordinary business almost every night. Phones don't work. There's a shortage of food and meds, and many people are left homeless. Bruno and Marco have always been good friends. So when the war broke out, they decided to stick together. They met Pavla while scavenging for supplies. He used to be... Pogoran's star football player. Now he's just another homeless victim of war. They teamed up, hoping for the best. Well, that's already very... Oof. Uh, I think sitting on this side of the screen is, is good, so I'm just gonna stay there for now. Time is passing. Okay, and when I pause, it's just pause. So first day, 6 in the morning, half past 6 in the morning, 22 Celsius. Here are our things. Drag for more. Okay, I can't drag this. Our things. Some thoughts. We thought about this. We, we got nothing. I want bottom left for camera. Okay, perfect. I will ask for help if I need it. Thank you. Maybe I don't have anything yet. Yep. Some thoughts. Our shelter is one depress depressingly ugly ruin. We should do something about it. We only have one chair. We like beds and we have to sleep on the floor. It's hard to get a good night's sleep on hard, cold concrete. And the condition of those who are sick or wounded may drastically worsen. We don't have a radio. We don't know what's going on in the city. We really miss books. A good book could help us forget the horrors of war. 
Staying here is slightly better than living on the streets. We lack cigarettes. We have breaches in the walls. Our shelter is not safe. And we have to constantly be on guard. Well, that's right. <laughs> One chair is all you need. End the day? No. Pavla is a fast runner. Bruno is a good cook. And Marco is a skilled scavenger who's slightly sick. Also, you're slightly wounded. Okay, what's this? Simple workshop. Household items. Bed. I need components and wood. I like that all of this takes time as well. You know, it's not just here I have the materials I crafted in a second, but it actually takes time. Okay, well I don't have any materials. So there's that, but eventually we need to we need to build cool stuff. Consumables, a filter. And fuel. Okay. And oh, this is for upgrading the workbench, of course. Um, we're lucky it's not cold in here. Yeah, so Bruno. Go, go through the door. Oh, open the door. What is this? Bruno just blinked. Did you see that too? Yeah. Bruno just blinked. If only I had some kind of shovel. I'm sorry, there's no, there's no shovel. What else can we do? Grab this. Got a backpack. Oh, it's not. It's not actually grab. This is sit down on the one chair that we have. Perfect. The game doesn't bother telling you everything. Anything it brings you to your safe house and leaves you to your devices. It. That's how it is in war, right? You. It just happens upon you. Suddenly, there's a war, and and you're there, and you don't know what to do. So while this is very harsh on a gamer perspective, I mean, it's also very harsh on a living perspective. So it does make sense. It does make sense. Do you think I'll be able to play that Harry Potter game coming out before the holidays this year? I don't know. I honestly don't know. It's, it is that person. You can set all three people to clear stuff at the same time. I'm aware. Yeah. No, I, I've played games before, Nick. Also, Nick. You've said I should ask for help if I don't know what to do. And I said, yes, I will do that if I don't know what to do. I haven't asked yet. Please. Thank you. People blink? Yeah, but like, that's just a, a profile picture, right? Usually those don't blink. Cool though. Very nice touch. I like it. I broke an axe. This game made you think more than most of what to do. Yeah. It's cool though. I I like it. Hey Dragon of Frost. You have this. What's my thoughts on it? I don't have any thoughts on it yet. I just started. I I don't know yet, except for that the atmosphere is very, very somber, very just dark and sad. But that's all I know so far. Hi Monzerium, hello. It makes you depressed. I understand. You don't obviously you don't have to watch. I don't understand if you if you don't if you don't want to. How do I how do I move around? I don't really. So you're still busy, okay. Oh. Materials. Eleven are those components? Components. Six wood. And electric parts. Probably shouldn't take all of them immediately, but... Oh, wow. Okay. We're searching this. All right. So we're, we're just searching everything. This is parts. Clean water. More electric parts. I don't think I need those right now. Let's just grab everything. What is this? Herbs. And the lockpick. Parts. I like the parts. Grab all. Oh, so it's like they've got a shared backpack. I like it. So it's not like 
person one has the wood now, person two has the herbs, and so on. Okay, good, good. I've not seen the game altered, no. Altus? Still haven't seen it, no. Hi, Johnny. Welcome. It's good to have you. I'm not sure, Skokland. I, I don't know anything about the game. I'll just I'll just play for now. We go. Oh, you're going up. What what about this? Oh, it has it has edge panning. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Is this a hole in the roof? We can still go there though. Okay. I suppose we also have, uh, like, we need food. There's hunger, right? Okay, we've gotten things here. I found a lockpick, so that should be... We should be able to open that now. You go... You go here. There's food. Raw food. And books. We wanted a book, right? Oh, no, wait. Oh, so I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I want you to go up here. Okay, so we're, we're finding lots of things. I'm not sure, like... Maybe we only, we only need to eat after... Uh, after a day or so. We'll see. It's the house supplies, yep. It seems like you're kind of stuck here. What if you go outside? What if you go here first? Look at that tree house. That's so nice. A bit of entertainment, exactly. We have that one book now. More parts, and we're gonna have a look at this. They're rummaging through here. Oh. Ah, that goes in the fridge automatically. Perfect. More parts. So... This person now, Bruno, good cook, will try to craft something now. Do they have skills, chat? Oh wait, there's a bio. Skill scavenger. They have bios. Let's let's read those. I remember watching a playthrough of the board game version of this game. According to one of the players who also played the video game, it was a good adaptation. I didn't know there was a board game. That's cool. Bruno the cook, famous for his cockroach burgers and rat skewers. Sometimes you just can't be picky. No skills. Okay, just that one trait. Okay, perfect. Hello, Juices. Welcome in. I'm playing this for the first time, so I'm just, you know, first day. I've heard lots of good things about this game. Does it make a difference if you leave the door open or not? I, I don't know. Marco. They thought I'd been through hell before. I'm a fireman. I've entertained blazing, I've entered blazing buildings to save lives more times than I care to remember. But back then I had people teamed up against a common foe, namely the fire. Nowadays, your former neighbor can kill you because your grandparents spoke a different language than his. This is true hell on earth. Drag for more, but once again, there's nothing more, okay. Havler. Before this whole mess began, I lived with my wife and son in the better part of the city. I haven't seen them in a long time. I hope they're okay. I'm not doing you so well, as you can see. Only he's football, football players during war. Nobody cares about sports when every day can be their last. So I scavenge the ruins like everyone else, hoping for the best. He's a fast runner, makes sense. And then Bruno, oh. And then Bruno. Before the war, I used to own a restaurant. I even had my own TV show, Bruno's Cuisine. I'm sure you've seen it. I visited beautiful places where I was filmed cooking exquisite dishes. All that seems of no importance now, don't you think? Nowadays, you're lucky if you get your hands on some canned meat or a bag of rice. And who knows how long this war is going to last. 
smoker. Well. Well, okay. Yeah, let's let's see. We need we need a bed. We can totally get more than one even. Drag to place on an empty destination. We does it matter? Let's place a bed here. And let's go. Mark and Pavla are total bros. <laughs> I'm gonna try to keep all of them alive, of course. Now you want to watch a show where professional chefs have to scavenge ingredients for food. Hmm. Wait, where are you going? You're sitting down on the chair. Have we been here before? Oh, you've got to dismantle this. Fair enough. You also built something. You are the good cook. Uh, go here, even though you're not the scavenger, but do this. We'll make another bed. They want to totally bonk down in the same room, right? Yeah, make another bed. Wouldn't it be nice that by the end of the first day they all had beds? <laughs> you still can't believe the Endless Dungeon ended. But but it is. We found a lockpick and jewellery. For bartering. We can lockpick up here? Oh, we also need to lockpick here. We need to wait though because we only have one, I suppose. Oh, never mind, it's actually locked. All right, well... Close the door. You've made another bed. We need one more bed. Even a chair is better than a cold heart floor. Yes, and we, we have one chair. But now we have three beds. Right there, this is perfect. And then I'm going to see what thoughts we have. This is closed now, right? Oh, no, no. Sorry. I moved, I moved the wrong person. This is closed. You're slightly sick. How about... <laughs> I yeah. see what you did there. I love this game. How about you go and sit down for a while and just chill out? Will, thank you so much for the 117 bits. I'm glad you like it. Oh, the night. What's it got an achievement? Diary? Hostels open. I think you will for the bits. I, I'm, I'm very hopeful about the game. Like, I haven't played the game yet, except for the first day, but so far, so good. Who's your favorite? Bruno, Marco, or Pavla? We're gonna plan the night. Okay, so during the night, this is a bit like... Now I forgot its name. Siege Survival. Where during the night you say, you know, you're gonna stay home, you're gonna go scavenge over there. Kind of thing. Marco? Bruno did not sleep in the bed? Why not? Oh, okay, well. What are the numbers near the bag? I suppose this is how much they scavenge if they were to scavenge. Oh, oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. Not sleeping in bed because... Because you're scavenging. Yeah, so I suppose it makes sense that the person who's slightly wounded and slightly sick, they're gonna sleep in the bed. And then Bruno is gonna scavenge and we're not gonna have anybody stand guard. There are inventory slots. Thank you. Okay, cool. I suppose I'm choosing what to do, yes. Thank you, Nick. I'm hopeful bits. about this game, oh you Thank sweet you. summer child if you only knew. Love this game. It was the cause of some of my favorite existential crises. Oh no. Oh no. But you know, I'm... I mean, hopeful in the sense of... I'm hoping this is gonna be amazing. It, it can be sad. 
it can be a drama, but it's still going to be amazing. Skoklon, that's, that's horrible. It's absolutely horrible. Do we trust the outers? No, we don't. There's an abandoned cottage. A family barricaded themselves in this house. But despite their efforts, loot has got inside. It's been abandoned ever since. Still, we might find some useful things that the loot has overlooked or left behind. Some food. Huge amounts of materials. Some meds. Lots of weapons. Lots of parts. There's also the ruined villa. And the quiet house. But a pendant cottage sounds great. We'll do that. So Bruno's gonna scavenge. Marco and Pavle go sleep in the bed. And heal up. There's a backpack, okay. Um, don't take anything with you. You'll be, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Scavenge, let's go. We will see. Hello, space catcher. Welcome. Oh, I am actually scavenging. Oh, this is. Oh god. Oh god. What have I done? Um. I don't know them, Will. I'm playing for the first time. No spoilers, please. The ruined villa, the abandoned cottage, the quiet house. What can go wrong? I'll show you. The looters must have been in a hurry. There's still lots of stuff left. Okay, I've got fists to fight with because I don't have any weapons. There's a broken toy. Well, I don't think I need this. Chat, do I need a broken toy? It's a sniper here. That's not good. Uh oh, what's this? Oh god. Lots of parts. A little concerned about what's written there. You mean the sniper on the wall? Yeah. Yeah. I'm- I just- this is the first night and yes, it's totally at the beginning. Never played before. First- first playthrough. Okay. I can barter it, it's not a priority. Right, we'll, we'll just go get something else instead then. Something that we can use immediately. Just try not to step on mushrooms. Different game. This is scary over there. I'm gonna go down here. Is anybody down here? It is... It is almost 10. I, I feel like I'm being too loud here. And apparently something something awesome is over there. That's it, I'm I'm full. What was that again? Parts. Okay, well run to XO oh, that that is loud. Don't do that. Qu quietly go to the uh, how do I not run? There we go. Bruno is back. What a success! <laughs> I survived the first night, I think. Achievement. Note. A bit of indulgence. Tonight at a really good haul. Look what I got. Night was calm. We survived the first day and night. Look at us. Perfect. Some weird things can be traded later. I, I found jewellery and I read that can be traded. It didn't say that for the bear though. That's why I asked. You don't even remember your first run. You just remember being sad and you lost them all. Oh no. The advantage of the toy as a trader was that it sits in a stack of four. Noted. Noted. Double click is running. Right. Yeah, we should definitely throw a party. Yeah? Anybody got some food? I know. I know people are spoiling, but yeah, people can't help themselves. What can you do? Bruno has been have been searching for supplies and brought some interesting things. Continue. So what can we do with this? Are you like super tired now? Where's everybody else? They're sleeping. It is 6 a.m. How about you're tired, right? And hungry. You're recovering from being wounded and you're recovering from being sick. Everybody's hungry. And I only have like one food. That's not, that's not good. Maybe I should have scavenged for food instead. Oh my gosh. 
Bruno must cook. I know Bruno's the cook. Okay, so if you if you go here and interact with this, are you gonna eat it or can I cook? Well, at least we made the beds for everybody. So, a simple heater, a radio. Oh, we could totally get a radio. Because then we know what's what's happening in this. In this world. Oh, it, the, the radio comes with legs. Uh, can I, can I move stuff around after I've built it? Can I move it somewhere else? Oh, of course, Goglin. <laughs> Hello, Bruno Max. <laughs> Hello. Um, don't think so. Okay. Can I put the radio... In the kitchen. In the middle of the kitchen. That looks like a living room. How about we put the radio in the living room? No need to run. You can just chill out, you know. Yep, no, that's the first meal. There we go. You're still hungry. I don't have any food left. There goes our food. Everybody's hungry. Try moving your bed. Well, I wouldn't know how. I can only click on it. Oh no, you have the shivers. I'm so sorry to hear that. Okay, day two. The rebel leader instructed us to warn the listeners not to cross the front line. Failure to comply could result in death. I can I can do that. Oh, this is so cool. The upcoming days should still be nice and warm. Perf for a stroll in the park. What park? Ads? Non-subs ads are gonna start very soon. Please stick around for them. Uh, they do support and disable pre-rolls. Thank you. One food is... I only had that one food and now it's gone. What, what can we do? I can't... No, I, I understand, Marco. I understand. Have a good day, alright? Maybe it's a secret code. Who knows? No? No. Alright. Let's let's see what we've got on the other side here. Despite desperate counterattacks by the rebels trying to lift the siege of Pogoran, the city remains cut off. Government forces do not allow any aid to reach the city, claiming it would end up in rebel hands. Music is playing. Okay. Uh, can I can I turn this off? What if what if other people come here and they they listen to this? Wouldn't that be bad? We're slightly wounded. Let's let's go build something else, shall we? Nineties music. <laughs> Is that nineties music? Is that in like what what's the setting of this? Is that an actual war, or is that just any war, really? We have the bed, we have the radio. A crude stove. I need to burn some fuel, made up of wood. Books are components. I need water to cook a meal. Okay. A metal workshop. I feel like we need a rainwater collector, but I don't have enough parts for it. Okay, we'll get a crude stove in the kitchen. I'm glad I didn't put the radio in the living room, uh, in the in the bedroom, because that would have been annoying. Oh, this is the siege of Sarajevo during the 90s. Oh, I see. 
let's have a look at our thoughts. We can get some respite, yes. We have beds and we sleep in decent conditions. If someone gets sick or wounded, they'll have a place to rest. We've made a radio and we like listening to it. We miss books. Oh, but we have a book. With breaches in the walls, our shelter is not safe. But I don't see a way yet of fixing those breaches. All right. Well, so if I haven't eaten that earlier, like, <laughs> oh no, you're still wounded. Are you still tired? Yes. I would love to be able to move the camera around with WASD. Question. Can I go scavenge during the day or can I only do that at night? I'm gonna make two fuel just so that once I need to cook something else, we can cook something else. I know, right? The profile pics blinking is so surprising. Only at night. Okay, thank you. Well, oopsie. Well, I guess we sleep during the day now. Although, wait. Are you... Who's the scavenger? You're the scavenger. You, you can still go and scavenge. This I can't reach right now. And then we can sleep during the day. There are no smokes left. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. You're still hungry. Could I go here? It's probably not a smart idea, but... Can I save any time? No. Okay. I know, I would I would love to turn off the radio because I, I find it slightly annoying, to be honest. What's the thing you do today? You think they, they're a group of vampires? Nah. Hey, what, what do you get? Hmm. A simple lock, you should be able to open it. Oh, you need tools for that. Oh, and this is... I can't go there. I suppose you go back to bed. To answer my question, yes, you can go outside there. There's no reason to do so, but yes, you can. <laughs> Good to know. Tune it to a random station. Okay. Let's tune it to a random station. They close the door again when they walk through, which is which is good. The music volume. Mm, I mean there is volume, but I don't think there is one for the radio. Hi Norals, good to see you. Radio achievement. Note. Bless the radio. Oh, I see. So if there's no station active, then it's just... Ah, oh, thank you. Oh, because that was annoying. The radio is useful beyond expectations. We get the news and it's so good to be reminded of normal life and the wide world. Yeah, right. Yeah, no, that's, that was just me walking back inside the house. I was, I was outside. Hello, Magadogger. Long time like, thank you very much. It was amazing and very touching. You want to play it after you heard stories of the war from a close friend of yours. Oof. Oof. That's rough. I've, I've never played the game before. Um, I heard good things about it. Good in the sense of it's an amazing game despite what it... what you play through, right? Besides the theme. So I'm, I'm kind of excited about playing it. Also, yes, it's, it's, it's a bit rough considering there's a war currently. I mean, there's, there's kind of always a wall right now, but yeah. Yeah, I hope I like it. Thank you very much for lurking and, and greetings from Vienna. Hello, Fawning. Welcome, welcome. It's good to see you. You watched the Twitch recap. And it for 20 days and hours. Oh, four days, 20 hours of streaming last month. <laughs> I can sell my own crypto. Of course, of course. 
You have to go, Motine. Thank you for being here today. Have a lovely rest of your Tuesday. We'll see you soon, all right? Have a good one. Is it still hot? No. It is. It is totally all right now, which is very nice. Yeah, I don't. I can't scavenge anything else. We're just gonna all go to bed, and I'll end the day. And we'll scavenge during the night. Hopefully, don't starve. And we'll see. Ah, uh, hello, Celia's. But the heat wave for now is over. You're not tired. Well then. So hungry and still hungry. There's a supermarket. A shell school? I've visited this, but only once. You're still sick. I don't care, you only one person can scavenge, I see. What if we go to the supermarket? It's located in the area, remaining under military control, but people are still trying to scavenge it for supplies. We can expect to meet other scavengers there. It's probably best not to get in their way. Some doors still might still be locked. A crowbar could come in handy. I don't think I'm ready for this. The shelled school. The school has been shelled several times. Unfortunately, most of the cellars have collapsed. It might be a good idea to bring a shovel. Don't have a shovel. They say some people still live here. Against all odds. They must have some supplies stocked, like canned food and possibly bandages or medicine. But they don't want to trade. If we're desperate, we could try to steal from them. A quiet house. It's in a housing estate that remains almost untouched. It's a calm area of little houses with porches and gardens. Most of those houses are still inhabited. People are trying to lead normal lives there. We've got nothing to look for there, unless we're willing to steal. Well, so I guess I go back to the abandoned cottage and, um, I don't know, meet whoever is there. Right? Right, you're gonna sleep in the bed, and you, despite being sick, gonna scavenge. I'm not gonna bring anything. We'll just go. Okay, wish me luck. It's a new night. We'll... We'll see. I'll go back down here because there was still wood here. I would I would love to get some food though. I'm very scared by those red dots. It's like somebody's moving there, right? Can we go here? Oh god, I can. Oh no. Teddy bear. Oh wait, all of this. You can carry lots, right? I can drop stuff if I don't need it. They're coming back. Are they coming back? I'm scared. Is this a scary game? Asking for a friend? Oh, that's food! No, that's fertilizer. Organic waste. No! We can eat that, right? Wait, we have a garden? The fertilizer it can be used in our garden to grow. Uh, herbs or veggies. Quality roll-up. Weapon parts. <gasps> oh, roll-up! That's in a cigarette! Well, I'll, I'll take a cigarette thing for you. The scariest will can be. Hi, Slowbro. He's not the only one who can scavenge. He's only skillful. No, no, but as soon as I set another one to scavenge, the one that was previously set to scavenge uh, was set to sleeping. So I can only ever send one person out to scavenge at night. That's what I meant at the same time. I know everybody can scavenge, but like only one at a time. I hope it pauses when I'm in the inventory, I'm actually not sure. You see you see the time here, it's, it's blurry, but it seems like it's not moving, so I, I hope so. More sus suspenseful than scary. Well, I'm sure it's gonna scare me though. Resources are limited, yeah, yeah, no, I get that. 
My doorbell is more scary. We'll, we'll see about that. Hello. They're coming back. Uh oh. Can they see me? For science, I'm gonna try something. Well. Should I maybe go outside and make some noise? So that they go outside, so that I can sneak in and steal something. Oh, never mind, they're going outside. All right, let's let's go grab everything. <laughs> this is great. We'll take this. And this, I have a full stack. Perfect. Go to the fridge. Go to the fridge. Go to the fridge. Please be food. Please be food. Oh! <gasps> food. What does that do? Sugar. Raw food. Vegetables. We probably also need water. What if I put wood in the fridge? <laughs> do you think they'd mind? Put wood in the fridge, but I'll take the herb, and I'll take your sugar. That's great, right? That's, that's how it goes. Perfect. It gets tense to meeting other people, I bet, yeah. Cigarettes. The thing is, I don't think we're going to trade cigarettes because one person, I think it's the cook, um, is a smoker. And he wants those cigarettes. Alright, well, I suppose that's good enough for now. A family photo of parents and two daughters. Good thing the girls don't resemble their father. He looks like a bear. That is so rude. Okay. Well, we'll we'll wait. And then go back. But that was good. We got food, so Bruno can now cook us something. Just be patient. How did you teleport back inside? Are you debating me? Maybe there is nothing. What the hell? Marco is back. Well, we survived. That was weird though. If you loom thrust door. Oh, look through. I see, I see. We've been raided. What? Also chat, don't spoiler, please. Please, don't do that. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Seriously. We've been raided. Someone came at night to take our things by force. Uh, apparently we had too many things. We were attacked at night. Someone tried to rob us. They didn't seem very determined, so they didn't do much harm. Too bad we had no weapons. None of us were wounded, but the attackers walked off with many valuable things. We should put more people on guard. Five water, two fuel, seven herbs, one electrical part, one part, and shells. Well... So about that, that's that's great. Good stuff. I still don't have a weapon. Bruno, cook us something, please. It's King of Early, right? That's fine. Hey, you're tired. Go to bed. You were just hungry. Okay, we're cooking. Make, make a thing. Wait, what is this? 
Simple cooked meal, more nutritious and tastier than raw food, because even better and more filling with vegetables. But it also needs five water. I think I'll just make one meal for each. Alright, so first the campfire. You go listen to the radio. Okay. No one's hurt or killed, that's true. But we are still injured and... Um, not you, Brady. Not you. Well, at least I didn't, I didn't read what you wrote as a spoiler, but... Anyway. Music is playing. Despite desperate counterattacks by the rebels trying to lift the siege of Hoveran, the city remains cut off. Government forces do not allow any aid to reach the city, claiming it would end up in rebel hands. We've already read this, though. Or listen to this, really. Not to cross the front line. Do I have to do this every day to check for news? No, it's still the same thing. Okay, food. Gib, gib food, please. Cook us something. How can I... I? Not a real question. But it told me about a garden. Let's see if we can do something at the workbench. Okay, so one person sleeps. The other person guards. The other person uh, scavengers. Apparently that's what we're doing. So Bruno is hungry. Let's go get food. We can make a chair. A rainwater collector. That's going to be amazing. A simple contraption to collect and filter rainwater needed for cooking and making alcohol. It might be wise to build a couple of them. It's also maybe used for collecting drinking water, right? Not just alcohol. Does that go outside here? Does it go in the front? Well, where does it go? Is the roof open? Does that work, Chad? This is a rainwater collector, but like, is the roof open? Did I put this here? You will check every day. Okay. 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 You don't need to open the roof. No, no, no. But is the roof open already? Because this is a rainwater. It will work. Okay. It can go anywhere. But that doesn't make any sense. Well, I'll say this is open, and we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna place it here. Pipe leads outside. Oh, well, fair enough. <coughs> Excuse me. Who are you? Wait, wait. Bruno, Bruno, open the door. It's a traitor. Hello. Are we gonna trade? Are we gonna trade? Oh, Franco. Hello, Franco. It's nice to meet you. Is that the stuff you stole from me during the night? Okay, so they have weapons. And books. We've got water. That's a lockpick, right? They have toilet paper with a plus on it. They have bandages. It's not, it's not toilet paper. I like to think they just place it somewhere. The, the roof's a bit broken. Yeah. Probably that. Between the shellings, I reckon the roof would get a lot of holes. It does look a bit holy, yes. Canned food. Hey, I have... I have this. Okay, you can have a jewel. I don't know what you do with it, really, but... You, you take this. And I'll get... Medications. I have to show you a lot in exchange. 
What? You don't take jewels for this? Well, I don't think we're gonna trade, chat. Tobacco. Try harder. I only have the jewels to trade. So. Oh god, Trollisco. This is so bad. Um, <laughs> the plus means triple ply. Perfect. Um, so I want your personal Yay! opinion. Drongo. Apparently, Drongo, I want your personal opinion too. Welcome in. How is your stream? Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome, Drongo and friends. Friendly kitten. Oh, Bora, it's good to see you. Set is fried. Doll. Hello. How are you? It's good to have you all. Thank you so much. I hope you had an amazing time with Minecraft. Minecraft? Well, that's... I didn't know you were playing Minecraft. Hope you had fun. Overstick Lock, Abraxas, welcome in. Hello. Meatloaf. And Vobara, thank you so much for 23 months of subscribing. Thank you. That's such a long time. Appreciate that. Welcome back. Enjoy the emotes. No ads. Thank you. Hello, Raptor. Good to see you here. I'm okay, Drongo. I'm okay. I'm waiting for my COVID test results. Let's not talk about that right now. You love this game. What do you think of it so far? I, I think it's great so far. This is only this, the third day. So I've only just started. This is a blind throw playthrough. I haven't played it before. Please don't spoil anything. Um... Yeah, but everybody, Drongo, amazing streamer from Australia. He's he's super fun, very entertaining, mindful as well. And apparently he streams Minecraft now, I didn't know that. Please go and drop him a follow if you haven't yet. And if you don't know me, hello, I'm Tutti Curie. And I like indie games, I like strategy games. We checked out the Open Death for Endless Dungeon earlier, and now, since there's kind of a lack of new game releases right now i thought i'll play a game from a backlog this war of mine here we are and and i want your opinion on something because there's there's one guy i think it's bruno who's a smoker and i found i found those cigarette things i, I found that found those cigarettes should we trade those or should we give him the cigarettes like i suppose he's gonna be angry if he can't smoke but eh, eh, I don't know hi healthy brand I hope so too friendly kids and I hope so too I played this a few years ago you keen to see how far it's come I'm playing the final cut by the way I actually hope I don't pass the test healthy brand don't want to pass it keep them Trade them is what you do IRL. Right? IRL, I would also trade them and say, you know, tough luck. It's just you trade. Trade, trade. Okay. Well, let's see. So if I trade this too. Can I get bandages? No. I don't think I can have anything, to be honest. Oh, wait. No, those are cigarettes again. Herbal meds. Simple medication. Sometimes they help, sometimes they don't. They're better than nothing. It's like... Uh... Homeopathy. How do you pronounce that in English? Trade them for something Bruno wants even more than the smoke. Food? Bruno's a cook, so probably food. Well, I, got, I can't trade anything anyways. Tobacco, herbs. It's very generous of you. Yeah, no, it's not gonna happen then. No, 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 no. I'm not interested. I'll regret the decision later. I'm sorry, I don't have anything for you. Wow. Well, now I made somebody mad. Perfect. Go to sleep. I have a rainwater collector. Clean water. There is no water right now. Okay, exit. We, we have this. This is great. Go get some food. And then you go get some food. Can you get food at the same time? 
You're not tired. Okay. Go go craft something. Smoke them all. I mean, I only have one, I suppose. Also, I'm not sure if it's, like, ready yet. It looks like we need to roll it up still. Oh, she's me. Homeopathy. Sure. Sure. Ah, try Star Sector. No, I didn't, but I'm not, not super into, like, sci-fi spaceship games. I don't know stasis. We could... We could craft this, a filter that we need for the for the rainwater collector. Suppose we can do that. They can't eat at the same time, so you haven't eaten yet. Oh, do I need to tell them to go away? Probably. Achievement. Shooting for five stars. For the first time since we wound up here, all of us ate a hot meal. Let's not get accustomed yet. Ah, right. So I, I need to tell them to leave, I see. Well, I can't do anything else. I suppose you can just stay in bed. Oh, we're not wounded anymore. We, as in Pavla, is not wounded anymore. That's perfect. Can't do anything else, so... We end the day. Good night. Good night. Alright, you're slightly sick. You're gonna... Hmm. I want you to scavenge. Um, the fast runner is gonna say guard. Bruno is gonna sleep. And we'll once again go back to the abandoned cottage. There's no food anymore, but there's still stuff. Lots of weapons. I need I need those weapons. Let's go. Did we check the radio today? Probably not. Ads are starting soon, non-subs. Ads help me stream full time. They disable the pre-rolls, so please stick around. Um you, you're probably not gonna miss anything. P probably. Okay, let's look through there. Right. How... how mean. The door's boarded up. Yeah, but it's, it's just a rat. Oh, a mouse. Which was spoiled. Bad chat. Very bad chat. What was here? The bear. I suppose I'll, I'll grab it. What was here? Here we have... Let's just grab all for now. And we'll go up here. The rats are devious. I was scared of them, you know? <laughs> Alright. If I click on bio, I see the thoughts of my people. No, that's not true. I need to click on backpack and I've already done that. Well, at least... At least I didn't do that earlier. I'll click on bio. Still the same. I mean, that might update over time. I don't know. Can I punch? Can I punch the rat? It's running away from me. Never, never mind then. The fridge. Grabble. It's over here. I want weapons. That was a spoiler, yes. That was a spoiler. Because I thought that was a person. I didn't realize it could be an animal, right? So I was, I was very tense and scared of it. But yeah, anyways, anyways. Um, I'm not gonna take this right now. I'm, I'm hoping for something better, something else. Can I unblock the door? And would I want to? Oh wait, first I need to go through the pile. We're just going to take a while because I don't have a shovel. What if we go up here? A note 
that says, On the first day, they robbed us. Two days later, they murdered our girls. I shot every one of them. But I don't want to see a gun anymore. It's broken and buried in the backyard. The next part looks shaky. If you're reading this, don't look for me. A gun? I mean, it's broken, but a gun? Sounds good. In the backyard. Uh, does that stack further? Yes, very good. The rest... I could take two of these still. Wait, as we look... Then we... I have something to take care of that, do I? Oh, is it because I don't have a lockpick with me? That's unfortunate. Oh, alright. Who on earth has the speed to punch a rat? I don't, I don't know. Oh, I forgot about this here. Yeah. Well, I suppose I'm gonna rummage through there. I know you could use a shovel. You could also use everything else, really. The night is halfway over already. Rats maybe delicious. I'm just thinking, you know, it's it's food. Yeah, it's a rat, but it's food. So we well, could we could eat it. Right? We could eat it. Well for now we just wait. And then we'll see. But there's supposedly there are lots of weapons here, so we haven't found any weapons. I've heard of rat catches, but not rat punches. Shovels over the week, punch your way through. See, we're just we're just using our fists for everything. That's that's how it's done, right? Would you bad? How so? Any anybody else? Is it bad for anybody else? I haven't changed anything. Should be fine. Maybe just Twitch thing? Refresh? But my tools should do the trick. I have something to take care of that. It is locked. I should be able to open it. Well, why don't, why don't you open it then? Punch it. Punch the door. No? Good here, it's fine. Odd. Dude. Dude, you don't have any tools for... Okay, note to self. Next time, bring bring a lockpick. Your headphones came partially unplugged. All good. All good. I, I know the feeling all too well. I, I understand. It's, it's fine. All right, well, I, su I suppose we we'll go. Let's run to the exit. Perfect. Hello, Matt. Welcome. The game looks very interesting, but when you tried to play, your brain wasn't ready. I understand. Oh, wait. No, no, I did. Ah, oh, there was another teddy bear that I forgot to take now. I don't have crowbars. But it's not, it's not me incompetent. It's just you're doing something else. It's all good. What I usually do, and I think that's very funny, is... Wait, wait, wait. The night was calm. Okay, very good. Uh, what I usually do is I turn on my speakers, and then I sit down, and then I take my headphones, and then I work for hours and listen to things, you know, cut my videos, or listen to podcasts, and then I realize... Huh. Sounds a bit different today. And then I noticed that a sound doesn't come from headphones, but it comes from the speakers. I noticed that after hours. Yeah. Yeah, that's me. Carmine, hello. You have to quit this game. You got too stressful on an emotional level. The only game you would recommend, even though you had to stop halfway through. Understandable. Very understandable. You're tired. Go to bed. Be the only one who's not tired. You're hungry, though. Let's see if we can...
craft something. Because I've got lots of stuff. A metal workshop allows us to make tools such as shovels for clearing rubble, crowbars for breaking doors, and knives for self-defense. Later, we could use it to build more advanced tools or even repair firearms. That sounds perfect. I want this here. I think it's funny how when I tell them to craft something, or to build something really, they run there instead of walking. Oh yeah, no, sound, sound's coming out, definitely. I do that once too. Once? I do that like three times a week, probably. <laughs> oh, people are hungry. I can make two meals, I suppose. Not good. A crowbar. I can't make a shovel. I suppose I make a crowbar. Nice. Very nice. It's it's 17 Celsius. Very good. Very good. You lose your glasses while wearing them. That is That is very skilled. How? Do you forget that you wear them and then you just check and they're there? Cat reset the computer. Oh no. Welcome back. Uh Someone's at the door. They look like children. Alright, hello. Oh, mom is sick. Please help us. Oh, gosh. We live several blocks away from here. Our mom's very ill. She needs medications. Could you please spare any? Without your help, she will die. After daddy went to fight, we have only her. Please help us save her. Pretty sure we don't have medication. Mm. Next PC build a power button will not be on top of the case. <laughs> Mine is too, but then I don't have a cat. <laughs> have you learned anything from movies? These kids are skilled thieves. Yeah. I'm sorry. No, I, I can't change my mind. I'm sorry. Or, or two. I've got to do things and such. I have a crowbar, I can open this. I can't do anything else, but I need more components. And more components and wood. Alright, cool. But I have a crowbar. So I can break break I can break open stuff. I didn't expect you to turn your back on us. They're trying to make me feel bad. Ugh. Well, the, the 40 that throw rocks at your comedy in Battle Brothers. It's that a thing. It's open. Look at that! The bandages, food, materials, as in water, books. Isn't that amazing? Scobby, are you... are you... no. <gasps> Bio! Bio's blinking. Okay, there's, there's new stuff here. Day four. Those children asking for meds were out of luck. Our cabinet was empty. All this shelling, sniper fire, and lack of supplies makes you want to hide away, sit down, and cry. We cannot let them crush our spirit. We have to show them that they can't take away our dignity. It's difficult here. But you know how we did it on our street? How, how did you do it on your street? We'd have given these children meds if we'd only had any left. Sure. Sure we would have, Marco. <laughs> of course. Right. Why, why, why wouldn't we? Of course. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Totally. We're now gonna listen to the radio. I think it's starting to get, like, Cold, cold. So, what we have? The upcoming day should still be warm and, and nice, okay? Classical music. Uh, stay away from the front line. 
Oh, the city of Pogoran is suffering extreme shortages of even the most vital supplies. If this goes on, people will soon become scavengers and scouring the city for anything to use. Yeah. Yep, I've noticed. We've, we kind of already doing that. Time for a trip to the park, right? Because the weather's going to be nice, so we should go to the park. Yeah. Can we go here? Do I need to clear the rubble? Clear this first, okay. You're the fast runner. You're still sick, but you're recovering at least. Actually, you know what? You should go up here. And you should go down and cook. Okay. Pavla. Clear this, please. Alright, we need firewood. Oh, I can't make a meal with veggies only. Well, that's bad. And I don't have enough water either. I'll make firewood for now. You can get into this game. It's so depressing, sad and dark, yeah. I understand. I don't mind that. I know we need food. Well, I can make I can make one meal. I like an amazing meal. No, let's only make one. Okay. Yep, first time with it, Francis. And I really like it so far. But I've already I've already learned the hard way that you're supposed to guard the house at night. Because people came and stole lots of our things. Kind of kind of sad. Okay. We're almost done with this. I'm gonna break this open. Maybe there's something useful like water. Could use some water. Let's see. I thought that was something to click on, but that was just the light bulb in the bathroom. <laughs> okay. Welp indeed. So what we have. Medicine, herbs, water, but it's only one. Need more. Achievement. Finished ransacking. I can't tell you to cook while there's still food, can I? That's a bit silly. We've explored every nook and cranny of our ador abode. There's nothing useful left to find. We must venture outside. Yeah. I think Marco is gonna eat. Mar Marco's. Marco's here. Our things. You have. Oh no, there's durability in those things too. Oh, tools have durability, chat. Did I have one of the survivors keep watch last night? Yes. Yes, I did. You played until your peaceful find you had a stable thing going. You stopped because you couldn't bear the thought of them losing the little safety they had. Fair enough. Meds for the children? No, the children are gone. We just... No, no meds for them. Kind of... Kind of bad, right? Let's end the day. Oh no, I wanted to... Oh, I wanted to give you food, but I forgot. So... You will guard, you will sleep, you will scavenge. We can get lots of weapons still from me. I do have a crowbar now, so we're gonna go once again to the abandoned cottage. We'll bring the crowbar. 
And... Oh. Apparently I don't have a lockpick anymore. You use them. Apparently I broke the lockpick that I used. Fine. Okay, what's this? That should be the teddy bear. What's here? Was that here before? Oh, this is this is the backyard. Oh, I see. Right, because because I knew of the of the gun here, I found it now. All right, I can break this open. Perfect. Oh, thank you, Space Casher. I didn't know that lockpicks were single use. Now I do. So I just need to craft more. Which is a bit tricky because I don't have the resources, but I'll, I'll find them again. What's in here? Cigarettes. Coffee beans. Uh, medicine. Gunpowder. Ammunition for firearms. Well. Sweet. I've looked at this, right? The note. Oh yeah. Yeah, I've read this. Exciting. Oh no, I'm full. Let's break this open then. That's how the game rolls though. It wants you to learn by trial and error. Yep. Now it does. Glad you have that bar of crow with you. I know. I know. Me too. But now my inventory is full. So I suppose I, I've got to come back next day. Uh, there's, there's nothing we can just carry with us. Oh no, here. This, this stacks. This is perfect. I'll... I'll leave that one book behind. I'd rather take this with me for now. Am I gonna go lie down now? No, I am searching this. Bandages. Great. For when we need it. And then here. Ah, you can, you can prevent most of the hard lessons by assuming the game hates you. Lovely. Teddy bear with a book. Doesn't really matter, does it? I've got to come back anyways. The bear is for if there's another trader coming during the day, because that might happen. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll come back tomorrow. I can't kill the rat. Right, let's just leave. One more scavenging run. And then we're good. Hello, another junglist. Maybe the teddy bear wants to read the book. Possibly. Possibly. Marco is back. Everything should be fine because we guarded the house. You were a crazy person who plays this game without with a notepad. Otherwise, you can't remember how many materials you need to grab to make the next shelter build. I'd, I'd be the same, to be honest. Yep. It's looking all right here. Hello, Paul. Welcome. Hope you have an okay Tuesday. Make assaults. Hi. I'm not buying anything. We just we just stole that. Actually, we scavenged. There wasn't anybody around, so we scavenged. That's a lot of good stuff. You go and eat the food. Oh, we didn't get any water, though. You're hungry and tired. Get some rest. You're just hungry. And you are slightly sick and tired. Alright, let's let's listen to the radio. I'm afraid we don't have any water to cook some things. We we've just got to eat stuff raw again. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Paul. Feel better soon. I might I might have it right now actually. 
I'm not sure. I'm waiting for my test results. Is my water capture working? It should be working, yes. It's it's just that it not, it's not raining, but I'm going to check on it. Music is playing. Suffering shortages, we know. Most animals have disappeared from the streets. Keep that in mind when buying meat from dubious sources. Well, I wanted to get a rat dinner. Nice and warm days. Okay. I wanted to get a rat for dinner, but I know we're not allowed to. Oh. oh, I'm sorry, Paul. Are you feeling better already? I hope so. Um, so for me, I was I was at a convention this weekend and I got home Sunday night and Sunday night somebody texted me that they have COVID and I hang out with them on, on Saturday. And then this morning somebody else texted me that they've got COVID and I, I still had breakfast with them Sunday morning, so. I had a scratchy throat yesterday, I still have it today. I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm just paranoid or if I've got it, who knows. I'm waiting for the test results. Hello, Wim. Hi. You too into this game? You've added update the fandom wiki? Oh, that's so cool, though. I don't think that's too into something. That's just very dedicated and excited about it. I think that's awesome. Wikis live from people... Oh, live... Live because of people like you. That's awesome. Hi, Methylethyl. You would put all the loot at location in the closest container to the entrance exit. They're, they're like in a global thing. They're not actually in a container. They're just in the backpack ready. Hello, Wim. Happy Tuesday to you too. I did talk a lot over the weekend. I was at AC as well. So, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just worried about Amsterdam. Bruno. But yeah, the, so there's our things, right? And there's that. So it's not like I put them in this shelf and that cupboard. It's just our things. It's like this global storage thing. Oh yeah, yeah, no, I've got I've got my vaccine and the booster shot. So you know. On day six. Fever's broken, you're still not feeling great. If you have it, you won't be uncertain. No, no, that's not true. There's lots of people who just hardly feel it or not feel it at all and they have it. So, the con was amazing. It was absolutely amazing. It was so great. But, we'll see. Also, the friend of mine has just like a bit of sniffles and a bit of coughing. So, yeah. You put, say, the entire house loot in the container near the exit. Okay, I'm not, I'm not sure why you're saying that, though, because I can't do that. I don't think I can. Can I? Cigarettes consume per day three? Oh, I didn't know as long as you had cigarettes, they'll use them. Oh, you were not, you know what, you were not allowed to do that, dude. That's unfortunate. I do have a bit of water. We can make one more meal. Okay, perfect. Hi, Yabuk. Welcome. Oh, so I can... Oh, okay. I can put it out of there again. I see. I see. Or maybe not. Who knows? Welcome back, Cassie. Yes, everybody's alive. I'm gonna go check on the rainwater collector. Let's see. Easy gathering the next day. I, I, I really don't see how that would help anything. <gasps> Somebody's at the door. Also, I did get water. There it is. I get, I get four. For you. You're hungry and tired. But you're sick. All right, you go open the door. Do you think that's Frank again? Was it Frank? 
a good deal. It's a trader. Or at least they're trying to sell like that trader. Well, who knows? What's it gonna be? That's a good question. It is Franco again. Yes, it's the same one from before. Okay, this time I've got more. I also have teddy bears for you. I think we're gonna trade for a lockpick. Oh, and maybe water. I'm sure we need those. Need that. But I see the thing is, I don't have to run through the house. I'm not sure. I'm playing the final cut. Maybe it works differently in the final cut, but I don't have to run through the house. I'm confused. Crazy busy day. Start trading for your backflip work. Uh, oh yeah, this was mine, right? It was I. I had meant to play more endless dungeon today, and I did. But I beat it again, and you know, before it's giving me another headache, I thought let's just play something else. This was mine. There we are. Um. Oh, you mean the loot location house? I I understand now. I'm so sorry. I thought you meant my house, and I didn't understand what you meant. I understand. I understand, and yes, you are right. I agree. So it's a time save thing. No, I thought it was my house, and it, it didn't make any sense to me. I understand you now. Before we trade with this one, I need I need to quickly go to the bathroom. So I'm gonna. Just, I know, Kiri difficulty. I need to go to the bathroom, get something more to drink. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you enjoy this. I I do. It's it's a very dark, dark and sad game, but I do like it. Short break. Thank you for being here. Appreciate you. Check out the socials. Click the follow button in case you haven't followed yet. I can't really imagine, but in case you have, do it. I'll see you in a few minutes. Thank you. Here we are. I just had a, a quick snack, eating my leftover lunch. And now we're gonna we're gonna trade here. So Franco is back. Got something to trade. What what do we want? That's a very good question. Um most of our herbs got stolen. Um let's see, we could we could do with a bit of water. Can I, can I have this for jewelry? Fine, we can have a deal. Can I add something else? This is lockpick, right? Try harder. What about a diamond or like a jewel and a teddy bear or eight drops of water <laughs> and a lockpick? Sounds like a good idea. Ah. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if they were junkies or not, but they definitely sold my, my herbs and, like, so many other things. Hello, Theranum! Hi. How is your Tuesday? Are you happy? You, you seem very happy. Can't eat the diamonds. Yeah, but, like, why does the other person eat the diamonds? Like, who's... Hmm? I mean, non-vegetables. Yeah, but they... I mean, like, canned food, I suppose. Can I have one? Oh, well, well, there go the teddy bears. One jewel, four teddy bears for one can of food, one lockpick, and eight drops of water. Perfect. I just need to do the automot thing here. Um, that's that's our deal here. Thank you. We need food. I know. Goodbye. This part of town is dangerous. We'll try to come back. Palva, you're tired. Go back to bed. Bruno. You're hungry. Get some food. There's a there's a can of meat now. Or like a can of food. We can't cook with it though. Can we? No. Oh that's sad. You're hungry, well... <laughs> I suppose you're gonna get the canned food. Mm-hmm. Okay, maybe... Maybe we'll build something. Let's go here first. Yesterday I said I'll probably play the game. I played yesterday. 
And last hour. Actually, it's not the plan, no, because I started with it. Change of plans. But I started with it. Um, I played it for three hours, actually. Had a great time. Played one run with three characters, died. Played one run with two characters, won. And then I decided to switch over. So I missed it. Yeah, yeah, sorry. How goes the radio? I think I already listened to it today. I can actually craft a new lockpick, but I want a shovel. <gasps> oh, a weapon. I can get both. No, I can't. Oh, did it just shovel first? But a shovel is only a time thing. Let's get a knife. We need to protect ourselves. A shovel. But a shovel is just to save time, right? Isn't it? Not very tasty, but it's filling. Perfect. I'm glad you had that. You're tired. Go to bed. Could only make a lock paper. We have one right now. You smoking again? Oh. Should have traded those smokes. It's better to sit on chair than on the floor. We should build it to make this place more like home. It will be... It will make us feel better in these tough times. Nah. We have a chair. Who needs more than... Oh, we have to finish this. Who needs more than one chair? <laughs> what madness is this? <clears throat> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, about YouTube. There will be Endless Dungeon on YouTube tonight. Oh, that's just happening over time. Or well, maybe it's done now. I'm confused. I hope that HD version will be done processing by the time. If not, I'll have to use something else first. Okay, so that just happens. Like, I put a filter in there. I didn't realize that. I didn't realize it worked like that. Okay. So can I build another filter? You always sell the cigarettes as soon as possible so they can't use them up. Yeah, I didn't know they would just smoke them. It will. You need two chairs to sit. A second one to put your legs up. Okay, no, that, that's fair. That's fair. Okay, let's make another filter. And then we'll go to sleep. I mean, it's already 4pm, right? <laughs> time to... Time to go to bed. I suppose I could go up there and get some more water. Even though it's not raining, this is very strange. But yeah, that's that's how it works. Alright, yeah. Race against time to set up the filter. I, I, I don't think there's a reason not to run. Okay, you're doing this. End the day. It is the night. You're still slightly sick, come on. You guard, you sleep, you scavenge. Uh, abandoned cottage, yeah. Although that's not going to give us any food. People still live here against the laws. Hmm. If we're desperate, we steal. The school. Cellars have collapsed. Good idea to bring a shovel. And there are homeless people in there. I didn't, I didn't make a shovel. <laughs> Let's go to the cottage. We're just going to be tired. Uh, we're just going to be hungry for a day. But we'll be fine. I don't need to bring any tools. I just need to go there. So let's go there. Not aware of any reason not to run at home. Yeah. Yeah, because if you're not at home, then it's loud. I know that much. But if you if you're at home, nobody cares. Hi again, Essie. Good to have you. Hope you're doing well today. We go up here. 
There's the rat again. Boom. That is really cool. I can run against doors. Okay, grab all. Thank you. There was stuff still here. Unless you have a character that can't run. Ah, I see. Well. Alright, that's everything. You don't know... You don't know how to get there. What do you mean? Use... Use the stairs? Okay, so can I run against this now? You can dismantle it in a minute. Well, we're, we're gonna do that now because of reasons. Could have done that like three days ago. Okay. Run to the exit. I've gotten everything. Perfect. This is something in the backyard. I've already gotten that. I found a, a note saying that the broken gun is in the backyard and I've, I've gotten it. All right. I have the final cut version. Does that mean I have the DLCs too? We've been raided? No. We were attacked at night. Someone tried to rob us. Didn't seem very determined that we managed to fend them off. Thankfully, thankfully we were all armed. Pavlov was wounded, but the attackers didn't steal anything. We should get more people on guard. They didn't steal anything. Oh no! Again! Ah, oh, okay, well. Slightly wounded. So once again, Pavlo is wounded. Marco is still sick. Oh no. And you're just hungry. Slightly wounded. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. I can't craft anything right now. I don't have enough anything. Oh, maybe a shovel. Because going to the school sounds like a good idea. I did leave the knife behind. Yes, so they, they were armed. There we go. We could get a shovel. Perfect. Ah. <sighs> Final cut just means the patches and perhaps extra characters or something. Free updates. Okay, the DLCs I have to buy individually. Alright. Cool. Cool, cool. First, I've I've got to do I've got to play this. I have a shovel now. But I still can't I can't make a like a, a veggie garden or something, right? Oh, bio, here. I used to be an optimist. One of those people who'd have saw, sworn that war wouldn't come. Wars happened far away in third world countries, or so I thought. Even when I was listening to the news getting scarier day by day, I did not believe all that was about to happen. Yep. Yep. I mean, I'm not... I'm not in Ukraine right now, but yeah, yeah, it's crazy, isn't it? Ooh. Summon Euros on GOG for the season pass. Is that compatible with, compatible with Steam? Let's listen to the radio. Still nice and warm days coming up. Animals have disappeared and shortages of supplies. Nothing new? Uh we're we're good. We're good. We're just you know hungry. Wounded and sick. Okay. Well scavenge. Guard and guard. Although we've just been we've just been attacked. We're not going to be attacked again, right? <laughs> All right, well, you're going to sleep off your wound. Bruno is going to be on guard and Marco is going to go to the school. 
Oh, wait, it actually says percentage here. Cool. So, the school. Most of the cellars have collapsed. Shovel and tools. Homeless people have taken refuge inside the building. Um, crowbar, shovel, lockpick. Let's go. Hello, Squeak Harper. Hi, hi. It must be so unbelievable, even while it's going, going around you, like an act of nature, disaster perhaps. You might see the storm coming and know it will hit, but to actually believe it will come down with a ferocity that appears to have and experience it. It is very chilling. Yeah. No, I totally agree. Ah, oh, gambler's fallacy. Well, in before we get raided again, who knows? But we have a weapon, so at least we're going to fend them off, right? Right? I heard they had classes when the shelling started. Poor kids. Poor kids indeed. Hello? Anybody home? Don't mind me, I'm just stealing your stuff. Okay, we found wood and electric parts. And more wood. There is nothing in this room. It won't budge. Okay, so we have to go upstairs then. Music. I'm gonna I'm gonna get startled very soon. Only trash in those. Okay. Well I did wait, I did bring a shovel. Oh cool, and I, I use those this automatically. I thought I maybe have to equip it. It's a bit loud. In before, the building collapses. Oh, hopefully not. I always wanted to play this game, never got around to it. Same here. Same here. So I'm, I'm really excited about this now. I can't really say I'm happy playing it, but it's good. It's good so far. Don't tempt the game. I know. How do I find this game? I, I like it. I like, like it's it's a good game. I'm just you know, you know. Let's we'll see if we can find something else. Is that gonna budge? I'm gonna try from the other side. Okay, so there's there's still stuff there. There we go. Let's see. Even the hydration reminds there's a fly here, like a teeny tiny fly. I don't enjoy other people suffering. Not 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 there, no. Definitely not. I love Mid Studios. They're so talented. Yeah, they also made Frostpunk. Also not a very cheerful game. Okay, let's just go in here. So much easier with my shovel. I know! You're welcome. It's a good game, it's beautiful. It's horrifying, yeah. Yes, it is. There's something up here, too. Okay, so here we can just get lots and lots of resources. So something that I have to... Oh wait, I have a crowbar though. Or oh, we don't use the crowbar and just rip it open like that. That's how strong we are. All right. Well, I would have liked some food. Hmm. Didn't say there was food here. Probably not, huh? Hi, Scarfy. Yeah, it, it is very, uh, very topical right now, isn't it? 
which is sad. But it is topical. Okay, more more resources here. And I suppose I need to bring the shovel again next time. Ooh. Maybe not. All right. We can, we can use the shovel right now to clear this. Why would I want to go there, though? There must be something that I can't see yet. I really like the art side of the game. Yeah, I don't. I don't know why I why I did this, <laughs> but I did. If we go here. Okay, just lots and lots of materials. All right. We're gonna break this open from this. Ooh, I think Mystery's home. Scary! Have I been here before? I don't even remember now. Probably have. <gasps> don't don't scare me. Please don't scare me. Oh, I've not not been here before. Good thing I have a saw blade. Let's start cutting. I don't know have a saw blade game <laughs> i'm not sure why you say that i definitely don't have a saw blade i know i know there's always been wars going on definitely but now there's a war as close to me as never before so at least for me it's like even more topical a speech line is broke it, it is yes because i don't have that tool it said that earlier already, with a door that I couldn't open. Um, that was a crowbar, I think. The crowbar was at home, but it still said, Hey, a good thing I have my tool with me, but I didn't. Yeah. So, um, I can't carry anything anyways. I don't have a saw. Let's just go home, I suppose. Can't carry anything else. There's lots and lots of materials still here. No, I don't think they're being sarcastic. <laughs> that wouldn't make any sense in a game like this, I think. Okay, so what happened during the night at home? But please say you're okay. Yes, the night was calm. Also, got an achievement. Day seven. It's been seven days since we hold up here. Death is all around, but we've been lucky to keep everyone alive so far. Thanks for that. Okay, you're tired. Go to bed. You are hungry. You are tired. I don't want any food. <laughs> They're not going to be... They're not going to be around for much longer, right? Welcome back, Rings! Hi! How's your day been so far? Kosovo was close. Was that close as the Ukraine? But that... When was that? Because I might have been too young to just realize what that meant. Yeah. Yeah, I know I was seven. I, I did not realize that stuff was going on. Absolutely not. I was too young for that. I feel you. So your news that bombs were dropped like 150 kilometers from your house is not very comforting. Oh, Stigler. Stay safe. As much as you can. I know it's easy to say, but... Yep. Yeah. You're wondering. If you're constantly around idiotic people, is it possible... You could also become idiotic. <laughs> no, it's not like... It's not contagious, if that's what you're asking. Yugoslavia? Yeah, no, you're right. But I was I was too small then. I just... That's... That really... 
that didn't affect me. As horrible as that sounds, but that didn't affect me. Yeah, well... Hey, we need to get some food, chat. We're gonna get a simple heater. To prepare for winter, because we all know winter is coming. Put it... Doesn't matter where I put it. I'll put it in the living room. Perfect. Close to the border. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's scary. Very scary. And the night is dark and full of terrors. True. Raiders, for example. We have veggies. I suppose we can just eat the veggies. People are hungry, but they're not very hungry. Why are you getting up? No, no, no. Why, why are you getting up? Must, must have been me. Maybe I woke him up. You're wounded. You need to recover. Okay. Let's listen to the radio. Day seven. What we got? It's summer right now and you're melting. I'm sorry to hear that. I'm glad... Was this? Shortages. I'm glad that the heat wave here is over. It was it was really bad. Animals have disappeared. Classical music and nice and warm days. Okay. Are you done sleeping? Let's see. I didn't click on the bed. Oh. Clearly. Clearly. Ah, it happened. I woke him up and then I didn't put him back to bed. It's horrible. The things I do. Ah, uh, ads are going to start again in like a minute. So, non subscribers, you might see ads, but please stick around. They do support me. Thank you. Hmm. Which room would Mystery be asleep in if he was in the game? There's Megasol. Seriously, get a grip on yourself. Like, I feel like every time you're here, you're being rude. I'm not sure if that's just you. If you think it's funny, but like, I've got to put a stop to this. Seriously. Stop being rude. Unbelievable. Let's see when, if we can use the metal workbench to craft something else. I think a trader is coming back. I cannot. So, someone's at the door. Let's see. You brought something to barter. I don't have anything to barter. Well, cigarettes, maybe. Let's see if there's cigarettes left. Okay. Um, there are no cigarettes left. Oh, no. Oh, I should have traded them earlier. I suppose I could trade coffee. Is coffee valuable? Asking for a friend. Oh, wait. So just coffee is not good enough. I see. I have sugar. There'd be no moonshine without sugar. Oh, okay. I need that for making moonshine. I should probably keep it. I have books now, and it says a good book is uplifting. The more we have, the better. If times are hard, we can make them into fuel for our heater or stove. So I need to check if they actually read those now, because when I had my first book, they still said a book would be nice. But now I have four books. Maybe, maybe that's okay now. Just coffee is always good enough, right? <laughs> I mean, not for me, but right? Hello, Meowton. Good evening. I hope you're well. Also, you might still see ads. Need plenty of books, of course. So... What about... Oh, well, this is generous. Okay. This is still generous. This is not. Okay, three coffee beans. 
one herbal medicine, two rotten tomatoes, or two cans of food. Oh, there's also this food. I didn't see that earlier. Wait, that food is worth less? Oh, that's interesting. It's very generous of me. Okay, okay. Two just meat, one coffee bean, and herbal medicine. Here we go. Hi, Reza. What's up? Good evening. Hello. Oh, you got an ad for joining the German army? Oh, yeah, no, that's... Oh, oh. That's a bad ad for playing this game. Oops. Oops. I, I'm not responsible for the ads playing. I'm responsible for there being ads. But I have no... I have no control over the content of the ads. Oof. Well. <laughs> we don't drink coffee, Mega Salt. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm actually doing better than earlier, Reza. Uh, earlier, I, I felt like I had a fever. Now I'm okay again. Who knows? Who knows? Okay, deal. Thank you. So now we can cook something. Bruno is going to cook us two meals, because that's what we have. Two meals. Ah. <sighs> We need firewood. All right. You're recovering from the wound still. You're still recovering from being sick. Let's see if they can do that without having medicine. Although the uh, Marco was sick since day one. So it's, it's been a week by now. Did you hear that? I have, oh, oh no, 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 sorry. I didn't mean to wake you. Oh, say hi. Um, I have bubble wrap on my desk, and I just popped a bubble wrap. <laughs> ah. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. As our survivors progressively get worse, Kiri progressively gets better. There's a correlation, so I just keep on playing this game until I'm perfectly fine again, right? That's how it works. Yes. Um, wait, 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 I need to read up on this. <laughs> Mecha Salt, you're not close to neither me nor Mystery. We are not friends. You are a stranger. I don't know how clear I have to make this, okay? You have been warned several times. One more toe out of line and you are banned. They're not joking around, like just, you know, behave or you get banned. That's it. Last warning. Mods, that was the last warning. It's like, seriously. Nothing worse than accidentally waking them, but not sure if it means the tiredness recovery timer resets from it. Wait, there's a thing? Oh no. I hope, well... Well, I wake them up accidentally every now and then, it happens. I suppose Bruno can go hungry for a bit, he's also tired. The rest should probably eat something. Because then they they heal quicker, right? We had slightly sick, sick leave before. I think if you leave them in the bed, it helps. It should, because... So it says slightly wounded now, but once they're lying in bed with that, it says slightly wounded recovering. So, it will get better, absolutely. It hurts, but I'll manage. I'm sorry. So I'm, I'm gonna put you back to bed. And then, Marco, I have to wake you up one more time. Sorry about that. Go get some food. Freshly cooked for you. Not dubious meat at all. We got it from a trader. <clears throat> Probably a rat or a dog or something. 
Ah, oh, yeah, wake me up when September ends. Ooh. And going back to bed. 4 p.m. 20 degrees, so this is still fine. Okay. Because we're ready for another night of scavenging. Back at the school. We really need. We really need to get some food. I only got 8% of, of the school. Oh, look at those, a new one. Sniper Junction. The city center used to be beautiful, with parks, squares, and monuments surrounded by old buildings. Unfortunately, numerous incidents with civilians shot out there earned it the nickname Sniper Junction. We may find valuable things there, but it's very risky. Some food. Huge amounts of food in the school. I just need to find the cafeteria. I suppose we'll go back to the school then. Hello, dears. Such a good game. And the feels on the decisions. I haven't had to make any decisions yet. Please don't spoil us. It's, it's a great game. I am enjoying it very, very much. Sniper Junction. It sounds like a safe place. <laughs> hmm. Maybe not. Okay, you go scavenge, even though you're sick. You stand guard. You're wounded. You sleep. Perfect. It's a real place that existed during the actual siege. That's both horrible, but also amazing that they added that to the game and it's, you know, real or as real as can be, but also horrible to think that, you know, that was a thing. There's another new one, a small apartment building. This old apartment building is owned by an elderly couple and their son. They're still around, somehow managing to fend off looters. They probably have supplies like food and meds, but won't be willing to share them with us. We can try to steal or take them by force. Lockpicks might come in handy. I know what you mean with decisions. As in... Mystery's knocking. Yes, hello. Come in. Hi. How are you? Okay. Nan, noch nicht. Mystery home. I, I close the door, and I've got my mask here because. No, it's not. It's not the knocking thing. But I might. I might have COVID. I don't know. So we're we're separating right now. I've got the living room. I won the room lottery. I got the living room because I was here first. And mysteries in the rest of the apartment, I suppose. Um, until we get the test results. Uh, playing a game like this doesn't even bother you. I was hesitant. Wait, wait. I need to scroll up. I was hesitant to buy this game when it first came out because you were like, you get enough IRL, you'd rather escape into a fun game. Um, does it bother me? No. No, I am the ice queen. I like, sure, I start thinking about it and you know, there's the atmosphere and the music and I'm like, oh, I don't really want to do this now. Or, oh gosh, I don't have food, but eh. But on the other hand, it is a game for me. I know it's based on like real experiences, but it is a game and I, especially when streaming, my immersion is continuously broken by by chat, by looking at the camera, by looking at, I don't know, Discord, just everything. So it's very difficult for me when I'm streaming, but also when I'm not streaming, to really get attached to a game and get emotional. I'm, let's just say it's part of my brand, the Ice Queen. The attention to detail, absolutely. Uh, well, I don't know yet, Scarfy. We haven't thought about that. I get my test results in like a couple hours. Probably. Um, I haven't gotten them yet. I'll get them in a couple hours. And then I don't know what to do. I might sleep in the living room, possibly. Negative thoughts to the test is negative. This, this is totally how it works. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Chat is distracting? No. No. How could you be? 
Yeah, no, if, if you'd play this just by yourself without chat interruption, it would be absolutely dif different. But for me, it's like I'm just continuously pulled out of the game. So yeah, I hope so too. I hope so too. Negative thoughts. Oh, yeah. oh. Um, we go to school. Scavenge, guard, sleep. Yes, prepare. I might, I might need this again. So I'll take the shovel, the crowbar. I don't take the lockpick now. Actually, you know, I am very confident. No, no, I'll take it. I don't. Someone subbed. I don't have to grab all the resources that I find. I'll just go until I find food. So I'll take the tools. We go and search for food. If I don't find food, I grab everything else on the way back. That's what we're gonna do. Ah, of course you're not distracting. Of course not. And yeah, thank you so much for being super kind and generous and gifting a. Uh, not just one month, but three months of a sub to Myangton. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Super kind. What if someone else grabs the stuff while I'm gone? I don't think they do that. I really don't think so. You're the same way with games. You don't usually find yourself immersed in something like Doom. <laughs> I mean, I also wasn't immersed really in, in Ori. And other people found it super emotional and started crying, and I'm like, yeah, and no, it was nice. Oh yeah, this was bad from the other side. I opened this up. It was just rubble. I suppose now we're gonna drop down here. Oh yeah, there's a ladder. Never mind, there's a ladder. Have I checked this? I'm not sure where I stopped. Uh, okay. There is definitely stuff there, but not food. We need to find the cafeteria. Let's see. Yeah, I was crying during the new season of Stranger Things. It's, it's over now, right? I think I might just get those. Is it... Oh, what's this? That's a new icon. I can hide here. They took my food again. You can always count on friends. There's a person here. Well, what am I... What am I gonna do then? Oops. Well, don't mind me as I'm just walking here. I didn't mean to do that. All right. Well, there, yeah, there, there's that. Okay, I don't have a saw blade thingy, so I can't go there. What's what's this? The door is grated. I need a saw blade to get through. And then there's something in the back. Okay. So here are the homeless people. And apparently they don't hurt me. And I can just go there and steal stuff. The season is over now. Awesome. Okay, cool. So so Mystery and I are going to watch it then. Because we were waiting for the whole season to be there. So that we can binge it. Water. Water is good. We'll, oops, we'll take it. <clears throat> Let's move on. Good lucky they went hostile? I don't know. M maybe? Oh, four is the highest stack, I see. Where's your food? There's other people over there. Okay, what if we go upstairs? Hello. Oh wait, I was I was there earlier. Do you think they mind if I see something next to them? And punch them. I suppose I could, but the 
there's supposed to be like so much food in here. All right, let's break it open. With a crowbar instead of a lockpick. Ah. Uh, my thoughts, Mr. Lee, is that is is brilliant. It's a bit, it's a bit on the dark side, of course. It's an amazing game, though. It's it's brilliant. Don't touch our box. What if I want to touch the box? It's a note left for someone. I prepared the secret stash behind the fridge, like you asked. I already put some stuff there, so you can see it works for you. Where's the fridge? Well, I haven't found any food. There's supposed to be so much food here. Have you seen a fridge, Chad? Is this the fridge? Ah, <gasps> there's a fridge. Well. Well. Hi, Kevin, Rochelle, David, welcome in. First playthrough, yes. First playthrough. I'm in day seven, or night seven, really. I missed the cupboard. I might have. The game going all right? Like, nobody's died yet? Somebody got injured during a raid? Um, we'll see. No, 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 you can't backseat. You can't backseat. There's a thing next to the fridge. This here. Oh, here we are. What is this? Moonshine. Well, I found a bit of food. I suppose now I can just grab everything else. And then we go home. It's already very late. I took I took a long time just running around there. And and we're full. It was a successful haul though. Since they don't mind me, I'm just gonna run back. But yeah, there's there's so much more to get. Crafting materials. Something I'm not supposed to touch. But then also Um once I have a saw blade, I can get into two more rooms that I, that I couldn't before. Cool. Very cool. Nice. Is this randomized each time? I, that's a good question. I cannot answer that. I, I don't really think so. But maybe chat can answer that. Is it is it randomized? We got stuff. The night was calm, perfect. All right, you're tired. Go to bed. You're recovering. You're also tired. You're very hungry. But watch me. We make here firewood. What happens if we drink moonshine? And that's an actual question. Feel free to answer. Ah, oh, Frey, thank you so much for being here today. Have a lovely rest of your Tuesday. Appreciate you. Define randomized. As in... As in, if you... If you start a new playthrough, will the locations be in the same spots on the map? And also, will will the buildings look the same? Will the loot be in the same spot? That kind of thing. Drunkness. Sadness goes down. Oh, I haven't noticed they're being sad. We can sell it. Yeah. No, I meant I meant in the game. <laughs> I meant in the game. So hungry, I'd kill for a can of meat. No need to kill. You just cooked something. We need to make sure we have enough food for everybody. I know, I know. I wish I could help Bruno. He looks so hungry. Bruno just had food. Don't worry about yourself. Although Bruno is still hungry. Oh no. Every, everybody's hungry. Wait, wait. 
Oh, the kids are back. All right, nice and warm days. Music's playing. Uh, we regret to announce that our colleague, Joven, died this morning. He was shot by a sniper on his way to work. He will be missed. The rebel spokesman informed us that some districts might become inaccessible to civilians because the government forces are planning to storm the city. They hope to end the fight before the in international intervention. Which, yeah, okay. Well, there's, there's kids knocking at the door. Let's have a look. Sort of, it's a little more complicated. All right, all right. Building presets, they're fixed. Scenarios can be randomized. Okay. Okay, cool. What's up, kids? What do, what do you need? What's about our mother? We didn't find any medicine for her. I know she's very, very sick. Please, you must take her to the hospital. Please. There is still a hospital? Chat, what are we going to do? Are we going to help the kids and bring the mum to the hospital? Hmm. What do, you, what do you think? Should we? It's a trap. It's a trap, but let's help them. I think give me a sec. Just leaves the dialogue and you can go about your business, but the kids will not run away from you. Yes? Help? Hmm. Eat the kids. That's a great idea. We need the food anyways. Alright, let's say yes. Yeah, yeah, let's say yes. Well, Bruno. Good luck. Good luck. It's not a trap. Well, we'll see. We'll see. I'm helping them now. Let's see. What if we just end the day? Like, Marco is going to get food. And then maybe also medicine, because that's just... Marco is just not recovering. Ah, oh, it is a tough decision. Bruno leaves without any gear, I know, right? All he needs is two hands to carry the mum, right? Right? Okay. Well, you have something to eat. You've been sick for so long. It's probably wasted. But let's have some herbal medicine. And then you go back to bed. We'll, we'll just see what happens. You can take Kiri out of Frostpunk, but you can't take the Frostpunk out of Kiri. Eat the kids. Yeah, I know. I know. Well, it's just... You're on meds, you are recovering. Perfect. I wish I could fast forward now. There's no way to fast forward, is there? Hmm. Hmm. Well, I suppose we're just waiting now. Zoom. I just, just had to snooze an ad. Yeah, still day eight. Um. So far, we're alive. I'm not sure if Bruno is going to come back. No fast forward, okay. I suppose then I want to end the day, though. How long does it take to bring somebody to the hospital? A couple hours, right? Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. There's some bugs. All right. Well, what, what hospital? I don't know. I was surprised that there is a hospital still. Not sure. <laughs> a few hours on foot, probably. Yeah, of course we have to go on foot. Yeah. Hmm. Well. I guess we play the waiting game. The day is over soon anyways. Just a just a couple of miles, I suppose. A day, a day or two, really? Ah. 
The old hospital just past the sniper junction. Oops. I can't speed up time, no. Otherwise I would have already. I don't know. I'm just gonna wait until he comes back. If not, we just start a new day, I suppose. I don't know, but it's already seven, so I need I need to end now. Hmm. Well, I can I can already like say though that I think this game is really amazing, and I do like it a lot. It is it is dark and gritty, very atmospheric. I like it. I can definitely see Eleven Bit Studios in there. And if you'd like to see more of it, I'd be happy to stream this again tomorrow. Let's wait for Bruno. I'm, I'm trying. He's not coming back. I didn't check the time. I don't know when he left. But it's almost 8 p.m. The nights. Well, he's not. He's not coming back. Good stuff. Um. Well. I suppose... Hmm. Ah. Thank you for apologizing, Megasalt. We yeah, know people can leave, apparently. <laughs> I'm sorry, Reza. I might have ignored the hello, but I saw you afterwards. I suppose... You're gonna... You're gonna guard, you're gonna sleep. We're not gonna scavenge, and we're just gonna stay the night. Day nine. The night was calm. Bruno returned after helping get those children's mother to the hospital. Oh, look at that. Bruno's back. That's Marco. That's Bruno. Welcome back, Bruno. Perfect. Unsafe game progress will be lost. I suppose it's saved... With a new day. So, yeah. Yep, yep. He, he came back. Now, though, this was the start of my first playthrough of this Wolf Mine. Really, really cool game. It's been out for eight years now. But it's very topical, as it always is. But especially now, for me at least. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this in, in the sense of... I don't know. I don't know. But I hope you enjoyed it. You know what I mean. Um, anything else? Follow if you haven't yet. I like indie games and strategy games. And love to see you again. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe a different day. But follow so you don't miss another stream. Follow on social media as well. Check out YouTubes. But in any case, I wish you an amazing, amazing rest of your day. Thank you so much for the distraction today. For watching and hanging out and chatting. And of course, for the support, the bits and the subs, and the kind words, have a good time. I appreciate you all. Thank you for distracting me, for hanging out, for the support. See you soon. Take care. Keep hydrated.